Welcome back. We're going to be installing a receiver hitch on the Porsche Macan today. So I'm going to take you through the steps. It says moderate installation time of about one, one and a half hours. So let's see how long it takes. All right, so we have eight Torx 30 bits that we need to remove. Break all of them. Oh, there we go. Oh. All right. So I broke two of these plastic rivet pieces by pulling in an upward motion with the removal tool but if you push it to the side there's a little plastic opening so then they just pop off so I'm gonna need to get two replacement ones order those later all right so I just flipped the carpet out of the way into the passenger area um, so this spare tire holder just turns into place right here. So all you need to do is turn it to the left and pop it out. So we need to remove this little plastic trim. So we got a T30 bolt right here and then a T25 bolt on the top of the bumper. And then we're going to do the same thing on this side. And we got two T25 bolts. All right, when you remove the four T25 bolts from the fender liner, you can fold it back. You have one bolt T25 down there, another T25 right here, and then one more up here. Sorry, one more up here as well. So there's a bunch of wires uh, plugged into the sensors back here and the lights. I'm just going to move it out of the way instead of cutting the zip ties because uh, I just need access to this bottom area. All right, so I'm going to remove these 13 millimeter bolts right here so I can just take it all off in one piece. All right, so we have two U-bolts and then two bottom plates for the trunk. And then up here is where the U-bolts will go. And uh, the exhaust hangers will just hold it up with the original OEM bolts. All right, so we're gonna need to cut these two plugs out. So we uh, can drill through the pan and bolt up the bottom section of the hitch. Let's do that now. 
All right, so before we bolt this up, make sure these exhaust hangers, if you kept them on, sit on top of here before you bolt it up. It's gonna be heavier, but it was really hard to take this exhaust hanger off, so I'm doing it this way. So I was able to get it through enough metal so that it tells me where the center is. So I can just drill a half inch hole from this side. All right, so this bolt wasn't long enough. So then I went to Home Depot and got two bolts. I think this one should fit. It's a little bit longer, but just in case I got an even longer one. And then I'm going to add some of this stuff on the outside to seal uh, underneath the car. Make sure water doesn't get in the trunk. All right, so the bolts were too long. I'm going to put back the one that came with the set and then re-tighten it back up. Pounds. 